Hello everyone, welcome back. Here is Van Amsen uh, with another interesting coding problem. Today we will crack the search and search position challenge and we will be doing it in JavaScript. Uh, so let's get started. All right, so before we start uh, coding and implementing uh, our strategy, let's understand the problem. We are given a sorted array of distinct integer and target value. And our task is to return the index if the target is found. And if not, we return the index where it would be if it were inserted in order. And uh, to make it more challenging, our solution should be uh, a runtime complexity of O log n. So uh, O log n, the sweet spot, this means we need to leverage the power of binary search because uh, we have information that our array is already sorted. So we are going to start by defining our function. Uh, so it's predefined a search insert. Uh, it accepts uh, an array of number and uh, a target number. And next, uh, we set our pointer. So left and right and the start uh, and the end of the array. So uh, they will help us slice our search space uh, in half in each iteration. So that's why log n. So now uh, comes the uh, while loop uh, and the core of our binary search. So uh, in while loop, we will calculate the mid index and then check uh, three possible uh, statements. If the target is at the mid, we found uh, our mid position. If it's greater or if it's smaller. So let me implement it and I will explain everything right away. So left will be zero, right will be uh, num left, so ending position minus one, and while loop left is less than right, and let middle be math lower between left plus right divided by two, so middle element, and if num middle equals target, we return middle position, else if num mid less than target, so target is greater, so then left will be mid plus one, narrowing space, and else it's opposite, so right will be um, mid minus one. And finally, we return the left position. Okay, so let's run it to see if it's working for a given test case. Uh, so yeah, everything worked perfect. So uh, notice uh, how we are changing our left and right pointer based on the uh, comparison with the target. So this is the crux of the binary search algorithm. So uh, yeah, we're moving to uh, mid plus one or mid minus one, depending. Uh, and uh, also it's left or right uh, pointer. So finally, uh, if we exit the loop, uh, it means the target is not in the array because we didn't return midpoint. So, but remember, we don't return minus one. So we return the left pointer indicating there uh, where the target would fit in the sorted uh, array. So uh, there we have it. Now let's uh, test this function and see how it works for unsynthesis cases as well. So I'm running it. Uh, first run for this JavaScript code. And yeah, we beat 51% with respect to runtime and also 50% with respect to memory. So all good. And our function works like a charm. I hope uh, this tutorial was clear and you have learned something new today. And remember coding is all about practice. So don't just watch the video, code along. And after you are done, play around with the code, understand it, uh, challenge it and improve it. So, uh, and that's it for today's session. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button and share it with your fellow uh, coders friends. Also, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss out uh, on our future coding adventure and tutorials. Until next time, keep learning and happy coding.